Hello all and welcome back to my channel. My name is Chandramani Pandey and thank you very much for watching my other videos. Now let's see how we can collect and download Windows device logs without interrupting the users using collect diagnostic remote action. So to do this we have to go to the Microsoft Endpoint Manager Admin Center portal and under this we have to go to the devices. Under devices we have to go to the all devices and under all devices we have to select the device for now i am selecting test pc2 and this device is also online so i am clicking on test pc2 then we have to select the action and based on your resolution you might not able to see the collect diagnostic action under this pane so you have to click on the three dots and then you have to click on collect diagnostics and then we have to initiate the collect diagnostics now it's saying that collect diagnostic data is initiated and it's collecting the diagnostic and to download the diagnostic logs we have to click on device diagnostic under monitoring section here it is saying that ending diagnostic update and if you click on this it's saying that device diagnostic are pending updates and it is also providing the recommended step if the status is pending for more than 20 minutes make sure the device is online so the diagnostic can be collected and uploaded and if we are getting any error during the uh, diagnostic collection then we'll see the error under this error code now we can see that the device diagnostic data is collected and we have to download this diagnostic data and I am going to download this. Now the device diagnostic data is downloaded. I am going to open it. Now we can see that it is collecting the all relevant information to troubleshoot the things like it is collecting the Intune management extension log which is very helpful for application troubleshooting. It is also collecting the Windows update ETL files which is very helpful for troubleshooting the Windows update deployment related issues and it is also collecting other event viewer logs i hope this is an informative video for you thank you very much for watching this video